Karen Cashman writes historical novels for young adults. She was born on October 4, 1941 in Chicago, Illinois. At an early age, she discovered how wonderful a library could be and she loved and enjoyed to read books. Her favorite topic to read was fiction, but from time to time she will grab a non-fiction book on a specific topic and learn as much as she could. When she was around 12 years of age, she was interested in learning all about how anesthetics work and read medical books to find more information about it. Something interesting about her is that she also tried to learn to dance ballet through reading books. Karen and her friends used to practice ballet under Karen's instruction in her parents' garage. When she was still young, she wrote her first fiction play called Jingle Bagels, a Christmas story, in which Santa goes down the incorrect chimney and lands in a Jewish house during a religious celebration. She also wrote poems and movie scripts about the singer Elvis Presley. On an interview done by Scholastic, she states that she wanted to be a librarian, a movie star, or a tap dancer. Mish Cushman won a scholarship from Stanford University and graduated with a degree in English and Greek. After finishing college, she wanted to go to Greece and look for treasures in the ancient world. But instead, she worked in a telephone company and in different odd jobs. Until she met her husband, Philip Cushman. Both of them went back to school. She graduated with a master's degree in human behavior from the United States International University. Later on, she obtained a second master's degree in museum studies from the John F. Kennedy University. She read many books to her daughter, Leah. When her daughter moved on to read more adult books, Miss Cushman kept reading young adult literacy. She became interested in knowing what girls in another century or time went through when she saw her daughter and her friends struggle as they were growing up. Her interest about medieval England began when she was a young adult around 23 years old. She started to read English historical fiction. One of the reasons that she writes about medieval England is because she did not have to learn another language. She could easily translate from Middle English to Modern English. One of the things that she enjoys is listening to medieval music. Miss Cushman began to share her ideas about possible stories with her husband until he said to her to write the stories down. Miss Karen Cushman's first novel was published in 1995 when she was 53 years of age. Catherine Calberry won a Newbery Honor Award. She desires to accomplish an authentic description of Middle English, including the way people live, talk, and the food that they ate. Her research is intensive and to detail. 
She states that one of her favorite parts about writing is that she can sit around her room reading children's book and call it research. Stories are plays in medieval English. Stories are about very wealthy people and homeless and poor families. Her main characters are girls that are faced with difficult and human universal issues like love, distress, and accomplishments. After six months of her first novel being published, the midwife apprentice won the Newbery Medal in 1996. She got the idea for this book while writing her first one. She had done the research already, knew the village and the people, but it was until she thought about a homeless girl sleeping in a dung heap that she developed the story. The story is written in third person. The setting takes place in the last years of the 13th or beginnings of the 14th century in a small village in the United Kingdom. The main character is a girl between the ages of 12 or 13. She is homeless and is known as Brath. Because she's found sleeping in a pile of dung, she gets the name of Beetle from a midwife. The plot is about the tribulations and accomplishments of Beth, a homeless girl that learns to read through hearing a man read an encyclopedia. After being considered almost nothing, she gets to be an important person in her village. Miss Karen Cashman writes with great detail about her characters. In The Midwife Apprentice, she does not tell the exact age of Brad, but her physical description gives a clear idea on how old Brad could be. Her books had been translated in many languages, and she has won several awards, including the American Library Association Best Book List, the Notable Children Books, and the Recommended Books for the Reluctant Young Adult Readers. Miss Karen Cashman has written several books, including Ballad of Lucy Whipple, winner of the John and Patricia Berry Award, Rotsina, Matilda Bowen, The Loud Silence of Francis Green, she currently lives in an island close to Seattle, Washington with her husband and pets. When she's not writing, she likes to spend time in her garden.